you love and just take me for. I ain't did nothing but you hate me though. Oh, I use this right here to do the tracking. So, so both of them recording at the same time? Nah, this is controlling this, and this is recording That's this. That's crazy. Okay, I ain't never seen no shit like this. Hell yeah. Appreciate you. Let's get it. It's your man Apostle, only if it's dope media. Out here with one of my favorite personalities, D.I. Uh, the Henny Man. Battle Rap Trap is in the yeah. building. Hell yeah. Out here in Raleigh at the Civil War. First of all, man, let me congratulate you on how it seems. You just keep popping up everywhere, yeah. being a part of everything. Yeah, yeah. I like the joke that I, if I had two managers in my life, I want Ray J's manager and yours. <laughs> I'm my own manager, so let's <laughs> get it. Let's get the bag. <laughs> all right, so first thing, I see you battle rap, but I also see you manage to be impartial at the same time. Yeah, yeah. That's a quality that's very rare in this sport. Yeah, yeah. Can you please tell me how you manage to keep that? Um, I, I, yo, the integrity of my brand is is more important than anything. You know what I mean? Like, as far as battle rap trap. Right. You know what I mean? And Henny Man is a separate brand. You see what I'm saying? So I'm not going to keep on uh, bleaching my content, pushing myself as a battler with my skill in the ring should be able to do that. In interviews like this, where I get to talk about myself as a battler, is when I speak up the most about battling. When I'm doing my shows about these other talented individuals, I'm not gonna take time out to, from giving them their flowers to say, "Oh yeah, nigga, check out this battle of mine too." It's not. That's not. That's not what they did. You feel me? Right. Yeah. All right. Now I got a couple of peers down here that battle rap in North Carolina. They, they done got a few names, they battle PG Skillet, a few Fact, other shout, folks. Shout out, shout out PG, that's my nigga. My man Juice, he, he, he want to battle you, and, and he's afraid to try to contact you because lately everybody bag been ridiculous that they asked okay, for. Okay, okay. So what would you want for a one round battle to come down here to I, Carolina? Well, how about this, I won't say it on camera because if I do battle the nigga, it could be used as an angle, but that's what I will say. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm easy to work with. I'm easy to work with, especially if I uh, like the nigga's work that I'm okay. battling, you know what I mean? I'm easy to work with. I, I definitely ain't asked for no. I ain't even asking for a thousand dollars right now. I, so we you know, you I work that out. Yeah, I ain't even asking for a rack right now because it's, it's about to work for me right now. All right, Juice, you heard that. You heard that. Now, do you make music, bro? Fuck yeah, hell yeah. That's. I mean, that's where it started at. When I started, when I got in the battle rap, when I started my league, I didn't even battle at first. I only did uh, music. I started to push my music. You feel mm -hmm. me? So yeah, I, I definitely make music. But well, tell me, tell me, like I ain't heard no music. So where would I go, and what would you recommend that I listen to? Uh, I got a drink called Right Where I Belong. I dropped it last year. That's my last project, Fire. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Definitely got like 14 tracks on there. Check that out on all streaming platforms. I share everywhere. I got another joint on all streaming platforms. If you see Henny Man music, just click that shit. Or all just right. type it in the search engine, and it'll pop up. Trust me, believe that. You got videos and all that. All that hell yeah, I got, I got mad videos from here to California, man. Smoking in the mountains and shit. Yeah. Okay. Uh, now, a very important question for those in my field. Let's say you got a gift for camera work. Um, you got somewhat of a personality. You got a good voice. You know, mm -hmm. people, people like to tune in to what you have to say. Yeah. What would you say if you, how would you get into this game, like on a real level? You know what I'm saying? What, what some steps that, that we could take? From the outside yeah. to get inside. Yeah, stay active, stay consistent. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, showing faces is important. Start putting names to faces. Yeah, I mean, so motherfuckers are familiar with you, your camera, and all that. That's important. And staying consistent is the most important. Yeah, I mean, you got to make sure you're putting out that content so the people that come to you for that content. Don't just be a nigga who they stumble upon and don't never come back to. They they want to keep. Popping my, my shit, battle rap trap, and keep popping up in people's recommendations because I keep putting sh content out. If right. you don't keep putting it out, it's not gonna keep popping up. New people not gonna know how to find it, and then they not gonna stick around if it's not continuing to come. They are gonna go to the other sources. Right. You know what I mean, but yeah, hell yeah, it's, and, and and know what the fuck you talking about when you talking about this shit because some people just get on, get on camera because they feel like that's the popular thing to do right now. You know what I mean? say anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a bet. All right, well look, can can I get that only of his dope shout out, please? Oh uh, yeah, hey, first of all, shout out to the Travis. We are back, Glit. Only is dope. What's it? Only is dope TV. Only if it's dope. Only if it's dope. Shout out to y'all niggas, movement. I'm feeling the vibe, and I definitely come down here and fuck a nigga up. No jokes.